First, I want to uh, quickly uh, introduce the background of the industry. Um, uh, uh, firstly, although uh, from the competition of uh, new media, television still the most uh, widespread media uh, in China. I can give you some uh, very simple uh, numbers. Uh, there are 1.3 billion population and uh, over 300 uh, million families in China, and every three person uh, have one television. Uh, secondly, uh, the development of broadband construction, construction laid the foundation for internet TV industry in uh, China, and the China government uh, has, uh, has, uh, has claimed that uh, uh, in the year 2015, uh, uh, 250 million families were connected with connect with broadband, and uh, bro uh, brand wise will we, reach 100 MB in big cities in China. Um, but the problem is uh, less and less people watch television, traditional television programs in the past three to five years, uh, and. Uh, uh, aged people and the people uh, who living in uh, the rural area become the mainstream of the television audience. Uh, there are lots of uh, reasons, uh, such as uh, lack of content diversity uh, and uh, uh, rise, uh, rise of the other forms of, of entertainment, like online video, online game, and uh, 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 things like that. Uh, but the participants of the industry uh, are optimist to the prospects. Uh, they consider that uh, the development of online video cooperation like youku.com, which purchased tudo.com in the March of this year and became the largest uh, online video uh, producer uh, uh, in China. Uh, this online video cooperation will devote to the diversity uh, a diver, diver, diversified content. And uh, uh, industry participants want to provide a new service uh, which can integrate online video internet service with traditional uh, uh, television programs. Uh, and the new technologies make it uh, possible. Uh, internet TV, uh, which can combine the functions of uh, uh, traditional TV and uh, in, uh, internet, some internet functions, uh, and it can uh, maybe it uh, it can pull back the young people to the front of the uh, television screen. So uh, the partic participants of the industry uh, think that in the, uh, this industry has a potential, huge potential uh, business value, uh, and uh, they plan to fight for the fight for a good a go a go. Uh, they called. They call the golden time slot. It means uh, uh, we competi com competitive, comp compete with uh, other uh, new media uh, for the um, hours. Uh, uh, people uh, go to band before people go to band. Uh, next, I want to introduce some regulations on the industry. Uh, since TV set producers firstly pushed the development of internet TV industry in China for the purpose of uh, uh, advanced consumption, uh, this industry uh, has an image of hardware uh, at the very beginning. Uh, when we were talking about internet TV, uh, we just uh, talked about uh, how to produce and uh, sell uh, the hardware. Uh, for online video corporations, uh, they could find uh, very good opportunities to reach traditional audience, traditional t television audience, and make made profit uh, from download feeds or sub, uh, download feeds or subscriber feeds. Uh, as for the TV set uh, producers, uh, they could earn money uh, from uh, sale hardware uh, to customers who were attracted by various uh, contents and uh, services. Uh, but cooperation between online video corporations and uh, TV set producers were regarded as illegal in the year 2009. Uh, the state administration of radio, film, and television uh, issued a notice uh, and declared that uh, no matter uh, who want to join the industry, 
uh, should cooperate uh, only with the corporations with license issued by SARFT. And in April 2010, another two regulations issued by SARFT uh, proclaimed that content providers and uh, uh, content integrators uh, should have a license at the same time. Uh, in this context, uh, content providers means the state-owned uh, corporations, and they uh, mainly produce content or buy copyright uh, from other uh, content providers. And uh, content pro uh, integrators uh, mainly responsible for con constructor the platform. And uh, when you uh, turn on internet television set, set, uh, set uh, a platform will appear on the uh, television screen, and you can uh, choose what you want to watch from the uh, platform. Uh, after uh, these two uh, regulations, um, licensed corporations have right of speech, uh, but TV set producers have been omitted by the comp uh, competition. Uh, what they could do is to search cooperation with uh, licensed holders. Uh, and and uh, unlicensed uh, private online video corporations were permitted to provide content to the integrated platform uh, in October uh, 2011. Uh, as the regulation uh, said, uh, they must uh, cooperate with license holders and accept uh, censorship. Uh, from uh, 2010 to 2000, uh, 2011, uh, there are seven corporations who received internet TV license uh, issued by uh, SARFT. Next, uh, I want to introduce three main rings of the chain, chain of uh, industry. They are content providers, content integrators, and, uh, and the device producers. Content providers not, uh, include not, not only uh, the state-owned uh, corporations like uh, CCTV, uh, and uh, CRI, uh, China Radio International, but also some uh, private online video corporations like uh, pptv.com, yoku.com, or lightv.com. And uh, the table in this slide shows the content integrators. Uh, there are seven uh, license holders, and uh, you, may, uh, you will find uh, uh, some obvious features in this table. Uh, Seven license holders are all uh, provider, uh, content providers, and their background are traditional television. And there are two end device devices. Uh, uh, one is integrated machine, uh, two is set-top box. And the uh, brand of television uh, producers uh, mentioned in this slide uh, can, pro pro can, can provide both sorts of uh, uh, end devices. Oh, uh, that's, uh, 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 that's the, uh, in some information about the internet uh, TV uh, industry in China. Uh, uh, as far as I'm concerned, uh, I'm not as optimist uh, as the participant of this industry. Uh, because I think uh, uh, China has a very difficult, a uh, complicated, uh, ch th this industry in China has a very complicated structure uh, and uh, severe uh, censorship restrictions. So the uh, industry, um, uh, before they uh, start to make profit, uh, they will uh, face for face up with a lot of uh, problems. I, for for saving time, I just uh, list them in the PPT. And if we have uh, uh, time, we can uh, dis discuss it later. Thank you. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>